Welcome to Affording College with Aaron Green, founder and president of College Liftoff. Thank you, Deep Throaty Guy. So, the Columbus Dispatch recently published an article uh, about a local university offering full tuition scholarships to 20 Columbus public school grads each year. That's great news. That's wonderful news. It's absolutely great that this is happening. But you may be thinking, what about my kid? What does this really mean for my student? Well, let's let's debunk this article a bit. In fact, there's three main points we're going to take from this. The first one, who is this for and what that means for my student? So we're going to talk a little bit about that. The second is how it's being done along with college planning and college counseling through this nonprofit wing of the school district, which is really their college counseling wing, which most school districts have. And the third, the money, the money that's involved and why it's not a big deal, because the truth is this type of money is available to everyone. So let's back to the first point, though. Let's start with that one, the first main point. Who it's for and what does that mean for my student? Well, the truth is this is for underprivileged students. This is 20 full rides that are being offered. Uh, Totally great. What does that mean for my kid, though? And my kid may not fit this particular set. Well, the truth is it is a great program for those particular kids. And your kid may be academically strong, uh, may be doing a really great job. But let's put this in a great context. We're only talking about 20 here. This particular school has 2,200 students. So that's the first part. The second, how it's being done through this local nonprofit. Now, this is a local nonprofit wing for the college planning side of things for this particular school district, this local inner city school, which, again, everybody has one. So the question you're probably asking is, shouldn't we be getting this type of help from our guidance counselor? Should we be getting help for the whole college planning process through our guidance counselor and our college career planning counselor? Well, let's talk about that for in this way. In the state of Ohio, there is a ratio of 500 students to one guidance counselor and or college counselor. 500 to one. At College Liftoff, it takes us up to 39 to 40 hours to do this process well. And over two years, typically on average with each one of our clients, to go through this. Conversely, in high schools, with a 500 to one ratio of students to guidance counselors in this state, it's about an average of 18 minutes. That's how much time is used to spend about college counseling with your student. So that's, that's the second part of this and understanding that it's a lot more work than we're really offering up or what the school districts can even handle. Guidance counselors are great. We love them. They have a great part in this process. It just takes so much more to get through all of the things needed to go off to college. The third part, the money. This isn't really a stretch for this school. It's really not a big deal. This is offered for everyone if you know what to do with it. At College Liftoff, this is what we focus on every day, studying the financials. Let's take this particular school as an example. They're offering 20 full-ride scholarships to students in the Columbus City School District worth $188,000 apiece over the span of those four years. Did you know this school has an $800 million endowment fund? Well, what does that mean? What does that really mean? Well, let's take that in correlation to the amount of students that actually go there. This school has 2,200 students. Now, if you take the endowment of 800 million and divide it by 2,200 students, that gives you an average of $437,000 per student in endowments. That's two full rides for every single student that's already there. So that's where we want to take a look at this and see how do we use this to our advantage? This particular school is actually what we call need blind, basically meaning they don't take financial need into the calculation for how much money they're going to give you and your student. As a great example, we know of a particular student that came from Atlanta. The parent is a high up exec at uh, CNN. They just really wanted the student to be there. This student, even though they didn't need the money, was still getting more than half of their tuition paid through these endowments, through these scholarships from this particular school. That's what we do every day. Study the numbers. See how much is this school really going to cost you? So let's sum it up. Great article, great program, lots of money involved. This is really doing a lot to help some students that really need it. But in no way is this really hampering your student or you at all in this process. Again, this is something that we work with at College Left Off all day long, and we can help guide you through it, and we can give you some resources on it. So subscribe. Take a look through what we're doing on our website. Listen to more of these. We're going to have a lot more of these particular topics that we'll be covering going forward. 
Thanks for listening to Affording College with Aaron Green of College Liftoff. If you'd like more information, visit collegeliftoff.com.